Hello children, how are you all? I'm once again very happy to meet you all. We have been discussing about the A reading of our second unit, True Height. Hope you have watched all the three sessions and followed thoroughly. In this concluding session, I would like to discuss some of the possible discourses from True Height. Along with the lesson, I have been covering vocabulary and some of the grammar structures. So in this video, I'll, I'm not making anything ready-made for you, but I'll be guiding you, giving you some tips and facilitate you how to make a write-up. Yes, children, are you ready to note down the points with your books? And pens at the hope uh, we have been achieving all of our language objectives. So, if you have textbooks with you, you can turn to the page number 34 and 35. Yes, you can have it before you with your notebook and pen. So, let us see what are certain possible discourses from the reading A through height. As children, so first is let us. See what are the discourses we have. So part six, seventh, and eighth, you're already thorough with the learned the format how you could write some discourses. But the new thing you are exposed to this year, particular in ninth standard, you're going to write two papers. You'll have paper one and paper two in English. Is each class 40 40 marks, and we have three sections in each paper. Section A comprises of reading comprehension for 20 marks, and section B vocabulary and grammar for 10 marks, and section C is creative writing. In that, we have two questions one is major discourse, and one is minor discourse. So that is where really. You can prove yourself, your worth, and it's very scoring. So what are the discourses prescribed in our syllabus for paper one? Can you have a look on the slide? Yes, you can read along with me. In paper one, we have major discourses for 10 marks each. You have a choice in this. It's a narration, story or narrative, conversation, description, drama script a play or one act play or a short uh, we can say it as a, a skit yes next interview in choreography script and minor discourses for each car is five marks message notice and diary and coming to paper b biography essay letter report speech script minor discourses are poster, invitation, and profile. So uh, you should become thorough with all this. What are the things you should keep in mind when developing these write-ups and what is the format of it and the vocabulary we use, all these things. So, so only a few I can cover for you in this session. As children, is it interesting? Yeah, good. You all love in the sixth sense on making of a posters, invitations, yes. I hope uh, you all love in making creative, come up with creative ideas. Yes, thinking out of box, good. Right, children. So you have read the story of Michael Stone. Think of some world famous sporting personalities from India. Collect information about any one of them and write a biographical sketch. This, this a biography is about a person's uh, events of life. Okay. And because the major discourse, it, it uh, goes up to certain paragraphs. What are the sequence of uh, the events? Yes, children. So first of all, we should write the date and place of birth where the person have born, when he was born, so some information. And about the family, who are his parents, what are the names, what are they, 
okay and about his siblings if grandparents like that about his birth then comes his family then hardships and difficulties he faced why should i you were wondering why should i why did i use such words yes children any achiever usually sporting personality renowned personality means certainly is an achiever is a successful person who attained a feat so and for no one it is a bed of roses or else it's not a cake walk yes children even seeing in michael stone's life you're seeing how he was striving how he was sweating and how he believed in hard work relentlessly with regimented work workouts yes so with all this turmoil of physical mental and finally he could do it so that's why in any field anyone you have to have achieve your dreams reach certain height the true heights in life not only in dreams so he has should undergo a pathway so that's with the difficulties he faced you have to bring out in the biography and then achievements of the person coming to michael stone his achievements his personal best of 16 feet of 18 inches and then he crossed the next bar 17 feet then 17 feet 2 inches then 17 feet 4 inches it goes on so what are his achievements and uh, then comes the important events of the life of that person so anything to be any anecdotes you can quote from that person's life coming to michael stone so it is the moment when he could do he he won the final plunge yes how excited he was and envision his mother what his mother would be doing his father would be cheering yes the shedding the greatest tears tears of pride so certain an important events of that person life and inspiration to others or message to the society so his feet how could man is not an island yes no children he is a social animal certainly he'll impact he'll have a great impact on the people around and the pride of his family so coming to michael stone we seen how being a challenge person and a person with a, a special needs or differently abled how he could do this and how he is a great inspiration motivation to persons in other with such a great determination and dedication and discipline how he put what message he give to the society we had to write and contribution to the field and society what no his personal it is not only his personal achievement children he won the medal for the nation yes being an indian we all love uh, we are cricket loving people is yes? when god of cricket we say sachin tendulkar he won lot of he has a records for in his account is yes, the highest runs so whatever he did no we indians claim we india who as a whole nation we feel proud so what is his contribution not only in the sporting personalities if we take a biographical sketch of an environmentalist like that in other field in our district ramaya garu padmashri he he planted so many more than a crore saplings yes and out of his efforts the whole society is reaping or benefited uh, from his yes hard work so like that what is his contribution what is message what are the personal achievement misses awards and rewards and records what all he said step by step gradually consistently you have to develop a biographical sketch like this so you can write from michael stone after reading his biography you're inspired to write you can browse you can collect information uh, from various sources even in sixth class you have pt usha the Girl, golden goal oh, yes uh, and, and nathlet so yeah, any of uh, recently with pv sindhu who won medal for rising just badminton so one of the sports personality you collect and try to make up a biographical sketch let us go to the one minor discourse profile writing why i taken to discuss both together is that is a major discourse is that information what all we get when we put it in a tabular formula 
uh, form, it becomes a profile. Let me, it is a minor discourse profile mark. So I gave you a table here. At your uh, left hand, you have certain categories like name, date of birth, height. Why here height specifically means we are dealing with a sports personality. Yes. So always a physical fitness is very important or counted for a sports person. So his height and which team he represents, he or she, what sports or game he's associated with. Yes, with a football coefficient, take or else cricket. Yes, so many events are there. I already told what is a sport, individual events and group events. Then comes debut. Debut means when he entered, what is his first entry into that field as a champion at the school level, district, the zonal. So what is his first achievement that is called debut? When did he start his career with? And best in career, okay. It's in cricket, the IPR, he did a double centuries. Yes, what are some of the best achievements? Yes, we call this a masterpiece, even coming to artists. Yes, certain, even coming to a writer. Yes, certain writers which won him awards, brought him recognition. Yes, lots of, like that, the best in career. Then hobbies. Awards and medals, resist coming to sports personality. We have will have certain national level uh, awards given, awarded to them. Yes, so for bravery, Ashok Shikra, we say from here, Rona Charya for these people, yes, coaches and all like that. You can make a right or collect the gather information uh, at your right hand side exactly to that. In that uh, you see two columns and rows in the same row. You have to fill that information that uh, comes up, makes up a profile writing. So you do with the profile writing. If you collect the information of one sports personality, you attempt the same for the biographical sketch and profile writing. Then you become thorough with the, these two discourses. Yes, children, so we'll continue. So next, write few lines about yourself. Why? I uh, at uh, in the first session when we're discussing the face sheet, I asked you to write. So you had to dream, dream, dream high. The true high get reach means you have to set a goal first. You should have a vision in your mind. So, so which into which discourse it falls in, ma'am? You can ask me. It is. You can take it as an essay about yourself. Is so. Use following ideas to write effectively what are certain ideas, what is your goal at present. So being a ninth class child, you might be thinking a short term goals like next year SSC. So let me achieve certain GPA or certain points. Then what? Then next short term goals and long term goals we should have. What I want to become. Okay. So what is your at present goal? Okay. Then how could you go about achieving it? What is your present goal? What is your future goals? Is there any action plan in achieving it? You have to write it, write it up and I say it again, a major discourse for 10 marks. You have to write at least two to 200 to 250 words. Okay, not less than that. So you should give an action plan. If I want to become, uh, um, what's it, worker, like medical worker, like uh, what do we call new courses are coming. We know all can't become a doctor, like right? other. No, it's it's a heavy competition. Yes, paramedical. Then uh, what group I should opt for uh, by PC? Then what courses are available to in order to get seat into that course? Uh, uh, did I should I take up any entrance examination? What is the method of preparation? What are the subjects of which you should develop that passion? You should have the dream. If you have a dream, uh, ultimately you'll get the passion, you'll find a way. Yes, for children, if where there is a way, where there is a will, there is a way. Yes, you cannot deny that. So, how could you go about achieving certain action plan plan it and you have to work out not only planning is important how much planning is important equally and more important is to put the plan into action so you have to give a few points of that 
and which famous personality will be your inspiration either in sports or in dream or as you want to become a singer an artist or dancer yes so my dream so someone i want to become a social worker mother teresa i was greatly inspired by her selfless and sacrificing way of reaching the yes poorest of the poor how she is a saint of slum yes you learn some personality will be inspiring you so who is that and what way you are impacted and inspired by his or her works you can write them and how will achieving goal benefit you okay how will be it benefiting you how will so is it it's not only for my individual it gives me a life livelihood if you are a painter you could notice you, you could draw very well it's not mere drawing and hanging on the walls but it will fetch me my livelihood yes to live to survive and also fame and recognition in the society yes is supporting to a family so many needs of financially or socially yes this will be benefiting by achieving this feat for me yes and you said so these things how my dream it is you are planning for your future so that should be helpful for us to sustain ourselves yes to establish ourselves so all after having a plan of when you are putting them on paper use appropriate linkers focus on expression and essence of that um, matter and present your answer very briefly so in a same uh, i want to though i just gave you answer assignment in session 1 i would like to discuss once again elaborately because you need it children especially if my children uh talara that which is watching this when you're back to school or else i'll call you personally and ask you to send me your write up essay of about yourself about future plans what is your dreams and goals and how you are going to achieve it good children hope you are followed and uh, immediately after this watching this i hope you'll start writing pen your thoughts okay children the next i'll come up possible into this course from this lesson is an interview yes interview you all know an interview yes even in six the last three class standards you hope you have come across interview right yeah, yeah in eighth class we have no treasure within yes it's an interview with the famous architect yes children so here a journalist is talking let us take about michael only we'll imagine michael stone in that picture yes here we know the interviewee and interviewer interview will posing some questions interview will be answering yes we have seen now it is lot of exposure to tv and journalism we see lot of interviews yes children so how can we write a script of interview steps certain steps to be followed and we'll see so open with the formal greeting when you meet a personality who we go on interview children especially a famous personality yes so he could lend you your time a time schedule for you so you have to open with a formal greeting like hello sir good morning it's my pleasure okay to be with you welcome to our show so well so certain uh, formal greeting you have to open this interview and he'll be responding it's my pleasure to then first pose questions related to the family you know him don't ask what's your name some of my children we know him well because he's a well known person we are going to take his interview first first questions related to his family about his parents what is their contribution in his achievement how could they inspire him some yes children so certain questions you just make out first you have to prepare list out the questions when you're writing an interview then you only say to he process you are playing the role of interviewer and interviewees okay so related to family make a uh, uh, one or two two three questions then why did he choose that particular line 
coming to Michael Stone. Let us think why did you let us interview Michael Stone now. Why did he choose? It's his dream. Yes, always he has a feeling of flying. Yes, he always envisioned like he like soaring like an eagle. And his passion, his obsession, and mother added strength to his dreams. And father cooperated in bringing into reality. So why did he choose? So certain people are usually, you know, a family, a father and mother, doctors, they'll try to become doctors, scientists, the scientists, yes, poorly, say poorly. A family person simply is that is the inner circle. And coming to the next line, so in spite of some of the incidents or uh, something he touches mind. So what, why did he choose that particular line in sports or in career? Source of motivation. So how it has come. Uh, his biggest, in some questions you can frame this, what is your biggest moment? Okay. Some, uh, yeah, I was telling, you know, anecdotes, unforgettable, very memorable events have taken place when he achieved the feat or like that, what are his hobbies, what are your favorite books or cuisine or like that. You can ask some questions from that. Then about his future plans, next waters, next target, next achievement. And after the sports career ends, so what he is planning to do is also certain questions on about his future plan and what is the message, his message to the society. If I would ask, we, we would ask uh, Michael Stone, what is your message to us, Stone and class children? He'll give whatever you do, do it with dedication, determination and discipline, utter discipline. Yes, children, this three Ds should be in your mind. That is the coach dream. So he'll be telling you first, it's, it's not doing superficially or doing for someone else, but wholehearted involvement if you do something, when you will, okay, so you can do that. So that, that even in seventh class, you have a message from C.B. Raman. Now children, yes, he says he's, it's not the equipment you have, but it's always you should have inquiry. You have to explore your surroundings. So a piece of advice or he gives to the society. So in all these uh, areas which I give steps, uh, plan two, two questions. Because this uh, interview is a major discourse going to have 10 marks minimum or 10 questions along with, for I said, opening formal greeting. And we have to close with the leave taking. Thank you. I see you so wish you all the best for your career. Okay, it's a pleasure being with you. So like that, a, a former um, a closing remarks, you had to close the interview. Hope you will be writing that. Uh, you just imagine, uh, imaginary interview with Michael Stone. You are a journalist, uh, yes, representing some channel, TV9 or and do you got an opportunity to interview him? Is you consider as a privilege to list out some questions? What you would ask if you when you meet him, and what would be the possible answers? Because we have read his biography, so you have to make up answers from his side too, and uh, and neatly write it in your notebook. Okay, you have to close with the level taking. Okay, children. And now I have some points to ponder from this lesson. It's really, truly, truly inspirational. Not only to, to reach your true height, it's truly inspirational. Like how could a blind boy, a blind athlete could do that? I set a record in National Junior Olympics with all. So what was so, until this is, come, teacher, you said discourses. Why this now? Along with the discourses, discourses, write up a creative writing in the same way. You have a comprehensive questions, reading comprehension. Here's some questions like what was so special about Michael's achievement? Mm, yes, being blind. Yes. So uh, the, uh, you can see what was surprising there about Michael. Yes, what was surprising, I want to elaborate. So you could say throughout the lesson, if you are so keen and focusing keenly, uh, listened and read the lesson, you could see how he could envision all the time. He could feel, yes, he could feel 
uh, the chunks and just why can't see? you can see the why golden why wheat corns you could see no why he should feel yes you could see his mother he feel the crowd groan or roar. yes he heard he knew oh he could so it, since he couldn't see he could feel it he can understand it he can hear it he can envision his mother yes he are always dreaming why should his mother read la? numerous stories for him he can read himself because we have seen in the lesson no his uh, excellent uh, uh, academic record he has along with that he used to help his parents in his farm farm course yes because that's what it's 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 all that's the beauty of the story children no it's a suspense for us to, until the end yes so <clears throat> Uh, it's what is so surprising is you could feel and he when fell and flattered on that mat he could feel the sun he got he understood and at a certain point he was uh he seemed oblivious of the fact why he seemed he knew it no so all this all this the beauty of uh, um, this writer he made up the story and he gave us twist in the and can you say what are the feelings of michael when he set a new world record this uh, third question you can take it as a diary entry children you know to even uh, the seventh standard oliver to itself we uh, learn how to write when a uh, young oliver when he saw being newly yes exposed to the board members and the fears he underwent yes so you know what is diary writing so his feelings you can write in the form of a diary and already in the second session i asked you to describe the feelings of when he was taking his life uh, the final plunge stood on that runway with the pole uh, the anxious the anxiety he underwent is yes, in the form of description from 10 months all of the same feelings in the first person is a diary entry as children yes why was his life not going to be the same only just to recall some important and inspirational thoughts from the lesson i have this points to ponder for you as children and uh, hope you'll sincerely do the work is and uh, write all the right tips you're ready to show to your teachers and submit for evaluation thank you one and all god bless and i thank devo and all the members for giving me this opportunity hope it is a it's useful and a blessing to all the children okay children wish you all the best hopefully with the new assignment meeting you all thank you